Howdy, how's it going out there? I'm Joe and they've given me six minutes to get you in the know. Hey, that rhymes. Here's what we got in the show. More rhymes. The dramatic rescue of this lucky dog and monkeying around with poo. Stay tuned for that one. Last up to the unusual way that zookeepers in Kenya are looking after a monkey. Wildlife workers have had to come up with a really weird and slightly disgusting way to keep a baby monkey happy. Getting to know you, getting to know all about you. This is Betsy. She's an Angolan colobus monkey and at the time of filming was only a month old. Betsy was orphaned and found in a hotel on the south coast of Kenya. The manager phoned the Colobus Trust, who took her in. But they had a problem, as no one had managed to successfully hand-rear this type of monkey. Their stomachs are very sensitive, and they can get really ill without the right sort of bacteria. That's why, as well as the milk in this bottle, there's a tiny bit of monkey poo. We take a pea-sized amount um, once a week and just dissolve that into one of her bottles, and she drinks it. Um, and what that does is it, it gives her the bacteria that's coming st straight from the colobus stomach what they need um, for their stomach to function correctly and she's getting straight into her. So it's quite a, it's quite a strange concept feeding a, a monkey its own food but it, it's, it seems to have made a difference. In fact, Betsy has now survived for 53 days, longer than any other hand-reared Angolan colobus. So despite being small, she's a record breaker, all down to some powerful poo. Oh, sorry, you caught me just having some of my monkey poo. Only joking, it's just water. Anyway, that's it for today. See you tomorrow morning. Bye-bye.